Hi, I'm Darren from Blackmagic Design, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a DVE graphic wipe with your ATEM switcher. A DVE graphic wipe is a great way of transitioning between two of your sources using a graphic as part of the transition. So let's dive into the software and take a look at how that's set up. The first thing you want to make sure you have is some media for the graphic wipe. And you do so just by visiting the media tab at the bottom. And you can see here we have an empty media pool. Now to begin with, you might not have your own graphics, but that's fine because we actually provide some example graphics that you can try out and test in the first place. Simply visit the Blackmagic ATEM Switches application folder and look for example graphics. Within this, you have a folder called examples DVE graphic wipes. And here we have graphic wipe one and graphic wipe two. And you get to preview these at the bottom left of the media pool. I quite like graphic wipe two, so I'm gonna drag that one into my stills there. And as you can see, that's immediately become active in my media players and on the right hand side. Now I come back across to my switcher tab and what I need to do is go to the palettes. When palettes is selected, I simply click on the transitions tab. And as you can see, I'm presented with my different transitions that are available on my ATEM switcher and I need to select DVE. From DVE, we then need to select the wipe option, which is found just below next to the word effects. Once that's selected, you'll see that the fill source then becomes active. And in this case, as we saw earlier, we need to select media player one, which is where our graphic wipe lives. When we're happy with the source we have selected, we can then move across to the transition block, and here we need to select DVE. Once DVE is selected, you can see we are presented with our rate and we can choose at what rate we want to deliver the transition. So for example, I might select to have three seconds. Then when we're ready to perform the transition, we simply need to press the auto button on the software. And as you can see from my output, it's performing a three second transition using the graphic wipe to go between our two sources. In this case, the pianist and the guitarist. If however, I'm not too happy with the rate of that transition, I can simply adjust that. For example, one second and hit auto once again, and you get a much faster transition. And there you have it. Your DVE graphic wipe is set up and ready to use in your production. If you need any further information, please do visit our website at www.blackmagicdesign.com.